Happy Thursday. How you doing? I had to fix myself up this morning. Hey, I want to talk to you today about the secret path to God's blessings. How many of you know that God's blessings are all through the Bible? All of God's blessings. God's blessings, God's promises, there's hundreds of them. But people don't know how to get them. Nobody knows this but me. They don't know. Oh, they talk about it. Well, you got to have faith. You got to have faith. Well, faith will get your bills paid. Faith will get you healed. Nothing is impossible with faith. But that's not all. That's not it. That's not all there is to it. There's a lot more to it that none of these people ever thought of. They never really found out. They just still don't know it. I've been shouting it for 10 years, screaming it from the rooftops. They don't pay any attention to me. A lot of those people don't. The elites in the, in the Christian world don't pay attention. You know who they are. They're on TV. They, they don't know. They don't know what we know. They don't know what you know. You know more than those people you see on TV. If you've been watching these videos, they don't know. I'm going to tell you the secret path to God's blessings that they don't know. Say this with me on this happy Thursday. The rest of my life is the best of my life. The best of my life is the rest of my life. Everything I touch turns to gold. I am smart and getting smart every day. I am extremely talented. Everything always works out for me. That is one of the most important things you can say. How would you like to live your life with everything working out for you. You can have it. You absolutely can have that. Start talking like that. Amen. We can make it happen for you. Some of you people out there are on the secret path to God's blessings. And why are you on there? Because we put you on there. We put you on this path. There's a path. Amen. Now, some people are trying to get on it. There's something blocking it. Something blocking it. Amen. Glory to God. Hey, I want to get that taken care of today. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Tell everybody you know about these videos, please. The more people who subscribe to our YouTube channel and the more people who hit that like button on these videos, the better placement we get. For our videos. You can be an evangelist just by sharing these videos with all your friends. Text the people in your contact list. Say you gotta watch these videos. I get so many referrals and these referrals get blessed and they get healed. Glory to God. I mean some of them get miracles. It's really neat the way. I mean I had people call me yesterday say somebody told me to call you. Praise God. Praise God. The person who told you to call me is an evangelist of some kind. Amen. And you can, you'll receive a wonderful reward for doing that. So praise God, huh? Also, make sure you call me if you need your prayers answered today. And make sure you call me when you do your offerings and your donations. The secret path to God's blessing is something that all those people don't know. They don't know it. We were talking about this last night. And our, our fellowship meeting last night went past nine o'clock. We got involved in some just really neat discussions. We had a small group last night. We have a lot of people out of town, a lot of people on vacation. School's getting ready to start down here. 
And so there's a lot of things going on. So we had a small group. Uh, I don't know how many people were here. It's still a bunch. Our, our small group is still a bunch. But everybody on Wednesday night participates. We turned the cameras off. The cameras are all off. So people can just literally say anything they want. And they don't have any fear that what they're saying is being recorded. And one of the things we talked about was the fact that I am trying to get the ministers, the preachers, the priests to speak the blessing over their people, over the people that they minister to. And very few have gotten a hold of it. We went out west and did a conference a few years ago. They were meeting in casino rooms out in Nevada. They were meeting out there. So we went out there and did a like a five-day deal. Well, it was wonderful. And I mean, we, we, we filled up a, a big meeting room at one of the casinos, you know, where all the comedians and the, the named people come. We, we had a full room. It was really, it was great. It, it was really, it was just wild. We had great praise and worship there. And, and, and I taught on God's blessing. And of course, we got people healed at the same time. And I blessed that group. And I blessed that church that was trying to get started out there. Well, it went wild after we left. It, it, was, it, it just, it grew. I mean, it just grew right through the, through the roof. And they, they were hunting for a building big enough to hold them. And, and we've had this happen a lot of times where we've been churches take off. And what happened was they, they grew so big that two, two months after we left out there, they were having big name people in like Jesse Duplantis and people like that. Their church was big enough to support those people. I mean, this was really neat. But the pastor never really got a hold of speaking the blessing. He didn't get a hold of this blessing. And over the years, his huge group dwindled. And of course, they had some restrictions on that virus deal. But their church now is disbanded. I was so sad to hear that. Because that preacher out there never learned the secret. He didn't learn the secret. There's other preachers where we've been and taught on this did not hear the secret. He didn't hear the secret. I'll tell you who did. John Hagee did. Now, I was not at his church, but I sent him some information years and years ago. And two weeks later, watched him preach it on TV. Or two weeks later, after he got that information, he was on TBN preaching exactly what I had sent him. And he still speaks the blessing over his church. He got it. I praise God for him. For John Hagee, if, if, if you're in, and uh, where is he at, in Houston someplace? Go to his church. He speaks the blessing over people in his church. Every, every week he speaks it. I don't know anybody else who does. And yet I've been to so many churches and so many places and taught those people to do that. They didn't hear me. They didn't hear me. And so they wonder why their churches were not successful. Of course, the people in their churches, some of the people in their churches got a hold of this. They're still in touch with me and they're getting blessed. 
So they guess they got some blessed people in their church. But the pastors themselves have not gotten a hold of this. The secret that nobody else knows. Kenneth Copeland doesn't know this. Joyce Meyer doesn't know it. Joel Olstein doesn't know it. None of those people know it. Keith Moore doesn't know it. He's a wonderful faith teacher. What a, he's one of our teachers in Bible school. Kenneth Hagin never knew this. He never knew it. The people at Rama, they don't know this. They don't know. I've sent them books. They don't read it because who am I? They don't look at it. They, the secret, in some of their cases, is sitting in their drawer. They don't know it. The secret to getting God's people blessed is to break the curse of the law in their life. Kenneth Copeland did that in his own life. 1967. It's in one of his archive videos. He said, curse, I rebuke you in Jesus' name. He said, Pew! everything changed. The blessing started to come in. I got the video. I got the video. He did it. He did it. I did. The Lord had to show me to do it. I didn't know enough to do it. I saw Brother Copeland's video after I had done it myself. The Lord had to show me enough to break that. Praise God. But people don't know it. That's the secret. Breaking the curse, speaking the blessing. And then, if you will watch your words, your whole life will change. Glory to God. It will change. Hallelujah. Something needs to be spoken. Somebody needs to get a hold of this. I need to hear this on television. All these preachers on television. All this is right there. Somebody needs to send them these videos. Of course, they don't watch them anyway. People send me a lot of stuff. Most of it they don't watch. I don't, I don't have time. I don't have time to sit and watch videos. Amen. And some of them are good. Some of them are good. This secret... Share this, but I'll tell you who gets a hold of this sometimes is God's people. God's people instinctively, when you tell them the curse needs to be broken in their life, they'll go, yes, yes, because the Holy Spirit inside them will minister that to them. And their lives change. You would not believe to the degree that we have got people out there blessed. We've got people out there so blessed that people in their families say, your life is different. There's something different in your life. They can tell the secret. The secret path to all of God's blessings is to have the curse of the law broken in your life and the blessing spoken. You should be hooked up with a ministry that does that for you. I believe when you partner with a ministry, you should have access to the minister. Don't tell me your ministry is too big. Our ministry is huge. Yet I answer the phone all day long. And why? Because I want to get God's people blessed. Sometimes new people call me. I'll break the curse of the law in their life and speak a blessing over them. They hang up the phone and I go, there, one more blessed. One more blessed. I'm getting people blessed one at a time. Sometimes when I do Zoom meetings, I get the whole bunch of them blessed. But that's the secret. Now you know it. Share it. Tell everybody to watch these videos. Call me when you need prayer. Call me when you want to be blessed. Monday is blessing day. Friday is offering day. We, we bless the offerings. Amen. Glory to God. Share this, please. Subscribe. And call me when you do your offerings. And call me because I am determined that you are going to live a curse-free, blessed life. Share this secret.